the government propelled the earnings of controversial supplier Farmily Pharmaceutical Corporation from a capital outlay of 625,000 pesos in 2019 to a net income of 264.7 million pesos in 2020. Financial statements and notices obtained by Rappler show the company is poised to earn at least 2 billion more in additional pandemic contracts. Farmily's financial statement for 2020 shows its sales that year was a whopping 7.49 billion pesos. In 2020, the government awarded Farmily at least 7.9 billion pesos in pandemic contracts. Contracts accessed by Rappler from public databases show they have won at least four more pandemic contracts worth 2.3 billion pesos in 2021. One of the contracts worth 37.9 million pesos for 2 million face shields was awarded by the DOH on June 11, 2021. Farmily Pharma won that contract through a venture with a young company called Business Beyond Limits, OPC. The rest of the contracts Farmily Pharma won in 2021 are 507.3 million pesos for 517,613 personal protective equipment sets awarded by the Procurement Service of the Budget Department on May 19, 2021. 774.3 million pesos for 17,000 RT-PCR test kits awarded by PSDBM on June 2, 2021 and 1 billion pesos for 26,970 RT-PCR test kits awarded by PSDBM on July 26, 2021. Rappler's investigation shows Farmily Pharmaceutical Corporation is linked to President Rodrigo Duterte's former economic advisor, Michael Yang, through one of its owners, Singaporean Huang Zuyen.